Cam was running numbers on a good site for a new safe house. It's got a workshop, good location, and the full blessings of her predictive algorithms. Once you set up the safe house, we'll drop off the materials there. Or you could build your own platform somewhere else, I guess. Your call. Excuse me. The sensor sweep says you're clean. Hooray! We're bug free. I'm relieved, actually. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not so fast. Okay, have you eaten anything out there? Because if you have, they got you. No, I never eat anything. You see, that's smart. That's smart, man. S-M-A-R-T. But you gotta be careful. The Institute has these tiny microscopic robots in the food, man. And they report back. Tom, that's rubbish. You just don't get it, Carrington. The Institute is in your blood. They're in my blood. Absolutely not. Tom, we ran your tests extensively. We found red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets. Everything you'd expect. And that doesn't get you the least bit suspicious. The results were too perfect, too expected, and that's how they fool you. Could the Institute really do that? Look, everyone says Tinker Tom is crazy. Until I'm right, you gotta understand. Those Institute scientists have centuries on us. Just working like crazy little bees, dreaming up the most messed up stuff you can imagine. Remember, in the blood. Okay, okay. If you really want to be safe, let me give you a little shot. Des, Des, Desdemona says no one has to, but it will kill those little robots. There's battery acid in that serum of yours. You can't nuke an omelet without irradiating some eggs. You ready to shoot up? What's in the shot? We got algae, some yummy bacteria culture, and just a little bit of battery acid. But, but we gotta burn those babies out of you. It's a hard reboot of your system, man. Hit me, Tom. Yeah, now you talking. Now you're encouraging him. Hey, you, you get it, man. I make things around here. You, you go and do. You do whatever. And come back, and I will set you up. I'd appreciate the help. You and me, we will team up and kick those son of a bitches out of here. Now, I got all these ideas in my head. So building time. All along, the bastards have been teleporting personnel to the surface. Is there nothing they can't do?
us, but I don't think we're alone. We got fun time incoming. If they left anything useful for us. I hear something! Diamond City thinks it's got a lock. Excuse me. Welcome, my friend. Might I ask, do you have a Geiger counter? Mine is in the shop. You? I was expecting someone a bit more... Uh, armed. 
You're with our mutual friends, yes? Let's say I am. Of course. You've just joined, haven't you? All you need to know is this is the first stop for all our new packages. So maintaining proper security here and preventing any unnecessary delays is crucial. A trader always has to move his merchandise efficiently. And we're all about making good trade routes. Exactly. My current package has been in my possession far too long. I'm supposed to deliver the package to some place nearby. But raiders have complicated matters. So, if you could... Facilitate delivery. Hm. I can do that. It's scheduled to be a nighttime delivery. So, if you could clear out the undesirables before dawn, we can do this tonight. See you soon. Never let your guard completely down, even in a place like this. Get it? Because it's a dog. You're really thorough. You know that? Light him up! Stay gone. Don't look.
Hey there. Everything looks clear. This is H222. H2, here's the person I talked to you about. Nice to meet you, H2. Another person actually happy to meet me. This'll take some getting used to. Remember what I told you, H2. I'll fire up the signal. Hey, H2. From what I've been told, it's probably safer if I don't say anything. And I don't want to put there. you in any more danger. Time for me to go. Keep H2 safe. Someone will be here shortly. I appreciate the thought. It's just that you guys are all... Well, no one's ever stuck their neck out for me. I wanted to thank you. This world is overwhelming. But people like you make me feel better about coming here. I have a lot of questions, especially about the Institute. That's precisely what Mr. Stockton said I shouldn't talk about. At all. If I understand more about the Institute, I may be able to help you and others better. I'm sorry. I don't know much about the Institute. I worked the maintenance tunnels. Every day, for as long as I can remember. The only time I spoke to anyone was to acknowledge scientists' orders, and very rarely to other synths. I've talked more in the past few days than I have my entire life. So you know where the Institute is, right? Stockton already asked me that. I don't know. I really don't. He says no synths know. How or why that is, I can't say. How did you escape the Institute? The only thing I'll say is I had help. Sorry. It's the one thing I won't talk about. You worked with scientists? Yes. At least that's what we called them. My only interaction with them was to receive orders on what to clean. I would acknowledge my task and occasionally ask for necessary clarification, but that's really it. What do you know about the rest of the Institute? I heard there was a concourse above the tunnels. It's huge and big and green with, with many synths. But they're watched more carefully by the scientists. Mr. Stockton said very few synths from that section ever escape. What's life like for a synth in the Institute? Synths are expected to behave like machines. You await instructions, you execute instructions, you perform basic self-maintenance. Anything else is considered defective. And then the SRB comes. You mentioned the SRB. They're the ones that watch us to make sure we're not defective, to make sure we don't run. Since that get noticed, just disappear. I don't know where they go. Goodbye, H2. Thank you. You have no idea how nice it is just to talk to someone. Hey. Hmm? Hi. In the flesh. Your thoughts? The Brotherhood. In Capital Wasteland, they really weren't bad. But now... Didn't have anything else. Another time. Easy there. Don't shoot. Fix her, right? And my man Deacon, still with the same old face? What? It's been three whole months. You're getting slow. I keep meaning to go to the face doctor, but who has the time, right? I heard about you. Walked the Freedom Trail, cleared out Switchboard. Glad you joined the team. You here to pick up a package? Yeah, I'm, I'm here for the package. Speaking of which, hey, you, you okay? A little rattled, but I've never been better. The other man, he said I shouldn't talk too much. He told you right, H2. You'll need a real name and a new face, but we'll get to that. 
Oh, listen. There's more than raiders behind me. Afraid we need a little more help. What do you mean, a new face? We gotta file off the serial numbers on new arrivals. Make it hard for the Institute to find them. Most sense going for a brand new set of memories as well. You know, for that extra protection and all. But first, we gotta get them to safety. We need to get to Ticonderoga's safe house, my home. A lot of sense fresh off the boat crash there until we smuggle them out of the Commonwealth. You do anything else there? Most of what we do is look after the new guys. They usually got a million questions, so I try and answer as best I can. We got some of our own questions, too, about the Institute and whatnot. Agents sometimes drop by to lay low if the bad guys are on their tail. Never a dull moment. I'll lead the way. The time-honored tradition of looting. You are so dead. When you're done looting up, I'll be up ahead. up with a mortuary. You see where I'm going with this, right? Hi, Rise. And we're here. All in a night's work for you agent types. Huh. So, is this a normal operation? More than I'd like. Sometimes I can sneak our friends through all by my lonesome. But other times it's like the damn raiders are holding a convention. Working with you made it a whole lot easier. If you ever need grub, bullets, or just a power nap, take the elevator up to Tycon. My house is yours. And Deacon, try not to give the rookie too much shit. Deacon may be a terrible liar, but it always pays to have him on your side. Later.
terminal should open this. We'll secure the area. Mr. Stockton said I, I shouldn't say anything. Good old Tycon. Hey, nice job with H2. Thanks again. Commonwealth being safe at night. Again, the Commonwealth ain't safe at night. Tycon's one of the few places I feel safe.
lot of our people help us once, maybe twice a year with that. You jumped right into the deep end. That's not even worth picking up, boss. I'm in.
Tom needs you. He keeps bugging me about it. We got a lot of synths in play right now. Makes things really dangerous. The H-222 situation appears to have been resolved satisfactorily. But there's yet more to be done. Since the fall of the switchboard, we've ascertained the fate of all but two safe houses. I want you to check on Augusta. The safe houses are in trouble too? I thought only the switchboard was attacked. Ah, the Institute didn't content itself with just destroying our headquarters. No. They launched simultaneous strikes on all we hold dear. Herkimer and Allen's safe houses are both confirmed kills. Many fear Augusta will be added to that list. How bad did the Institute hurt us, Doc? Frankly, we're lucky there's a railroad left at all. I don't remember a time our numbers have been so few. But the mission carries on. Tell me about Augusta. Details await at the dead drop. Have a care. Odds are very good you're walking into something nasty. Glad you're with us. Confirmed. Agent Fixer has arrived. I have a mission for you. Without increasing efficiency of synth traffic flow, odds of entire organization being compromised increase daily. Solution. A new distribution center needs to be established. A distribution center? What's that? The railroad organization calls distribution centers safe houses. A place where synths are stored and then rerouted safely through the region known as the Commonwealth. Mission details commencing. Pacify the target location. Fortify position to protect current and future railroad assets. New distribution center will be codenamed Mercer Safe House. Good luck. One more hour until my shift ends. Hey. Tell me what you want. <clears throat> We've been traveling for a spell. I was hoping to have some words with you. What do you want to talk about? I'm used to flying solo, but I got to admit, working with you makes me think I've been missing out. Having someone watching your back is refreshing. Especially since you never know when the Institute is watching. You've never had a partner. Not for a long time. Besides, partnering up in the railroad can leave you vulnerable. One more person who can finger you to the Institute. Some people at HQ are jealous. You took the big nap and everyone you knew is long gone. Now, hear me out on the silver lining. If a human in the railroad slips up, then they expose friends and loved ones to danger. You're safe from that. Why would the people they care about be in danger? When the coursers start kicking down doors, they don't just hit railroad safe houses. Some friends and family have been known to get axed. Whether the Institute's motivated by vengeance or faulty intel, it doesn't matter to the people left behind. It doesn't matter much to me. I'm a synth. At least that's what they tell me. So I really don't have anything to lose. For Glory and me and the others, it's easier to dedicate ourselves to the cause. You're a synth? Why didn't you tell me before? I don't like talking about it. I was one of the first synths they did the whole cranium reboot on, so it was a bit of a botched job. Most synths have fun fake memories. A happy home, a family. Me, I got nothing. And that, well, it does something to you. Since we're traveling together, I want you to take this. It's my recall code. If you ever need to know something about the Institute, read it to me. If you expect me to believe you, I want proof. All right, you got me. No fooling you, huh? Don't take it personally. I lie to everyone. Maybe I'm just another human that has people back home he wants to protect. Then again, maybe not. <laughs>
I don't like being lied to. My relationship with the truth rubs some people the wrong way. But believe this one thing. I'm in your corner. Always have been. Not everyone can say that. That code I gave you is a hard truth. You can't trust everyone. Even if someone sounds sincere, they could be a synth replacement working for the Institute. The bitch of the problem is recognizing the 90% of the time someone's on the up and up and the 10% of the time you're being played. I suppose you're here for my medical services. Let's see what's wrong with you. Hey. You called? Heads up. What's on your mind? I think it's about time we called it quits. Been nice traveling with you. I'm sure I'll see you again. I'm like a bad penny. I'll keep turning up. The importance of Bunker Hill and our asset there is not widely known. Please keep it that way. Desdemona. It's not an easy road you've chosen, but you're never alone in this. the men of science and institutes of learning. Surely they are out there still.
hope you ain't one of them synths here to spy on me. It is hard to determine whether the surface is more or less susceptible to outbreaks, but a preparation plan is never a bad idea. Let me see and scan as many indigenous life forms as possible. It is a...